We are gathered here in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your mercy. Good morning, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. So today we celebrate this thanksgiving to God for our accomplishment, the motivation coming not by my own sins, but in my thoughts and my words, in what I have done and what I have made to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault, therefore I ask Blessed Mary of the Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Jesus said to him, I am the way and the truth 
and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Please be seated for the book. This is a penance, a guidance, and teachers behind backing up to face the reality of life. Life is not easy. You should always put it in your mind. As Scott Peck, a well-known writer and publisher of a good bestseller book, life is not easy. We must uh, refrain or uh, just put aside. Not stagnant, but always aiming what is ahead. What is there in our uh, uh, mission in life, in our journey's travel, what will be the end? What is our aim? We should establish our objectives so that we will find the conclusion based on what we are planning for, based on our study, based on our analysis of the possibility of making our life successful or not. But anyway, this is a fortune time for you, especially you students who undergone pandemic, two years of pandemic, at least now we have this face-to-face. -face. At least you come buds, I nagkaroon pa ng face-to-face, di ba? And then there's a gap, and then we have now this face-to-face -face graduation. And we are now hoping to have a face-to-face -face classes. Para medyo gumaan naman ng trabaho ni nanay ka. And you know that we want to stay at home at this moment of pandemic. Why? Those who are traveling out of their, uh, far from their family, they are always longing to go home, to go back to their family. And to our parents. I hope, no, meron pa sa hindi ba, na ang kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-kulit-
let us pray. O Lord, we ask you to bless these diplomas and medals, the fruits of many years and labor, they embody. Graciously strengthen our candidates for graduation to put into practice their learnings for your greater glory and for the service of their fellow men. Grant this to Christ our Lord and your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Glorifying the Lord by 